So all of you notice the homework sum, if you notice. So there is a spring, string ille, spring, and some mass is attached to that, M mass. And there is a string, again, the mass is attached, that is what, uh, 2M mass. And again, there is a spring, again, there is a mass, M is attached. So this is A and this is B and this is C. Now they are saying when the body is in equilibrium. So after the system attains equilibrium. Equilibrium means am I right or wrong everyone? So there is a little elongation of a spring. But is there any elongation of string? Anybody? No. Understand? No. So string will be always remains the uh, same length. But the spring will just it will show elongation as it is having an elastic in nature. So that is what after system attains, okay? So after a system attains equilibrium, equilibrium, so the string is S-T-R-I-N-G, the string is cut. So then they are asking find acceleration of A, acceleration of B, and as well as acceleration of C just after cutting. It's not that after long time, just after cutting, as soon as it is cutting, what is the acceleration of this all the three bodies? That is what they are asking. Am I right, everyone? Yes or no? So now, somebody called Mr. Rishi. Yeah, Mr. Monish, can you hear me? So, Narayan? So, I think Narayan already solved this. Yes, so, now let us uh, make it. Just a minute, everybody. So, I want to send one OTP. Okay, so now if you observe very carefully here, so I think uh, only that uh, Mr. Uh, Narayan already sent me on the day itself, I think he already solved. So now what they are saying, as soon as if we cut the string, so here, once they will attain the equilibrium, so we have to cut the string. So if you cut the string with a scissor, then what is the velocities of these three bodies they are asking. So as we know that, if you cut this weight as uh, this M body, this C body will go upward or downwards suddenly if I release the mass. Yes or no? It will go upward or downwards? Upward. upward. It will go upward direction. So let us start with this one. So we all know, we'll uh, come with this. So before cutting, let us identify what is the forces. So first this is, you have to redraw the question. But me, I will proceed with the same figure. So all of you observe very carefully. I will take now first, what is the weight acting by this body on the ground? ground everyone? Weight is equals to how much? Mg. So as we know, this is a spring. So that same spring means something which is acting upward direction. What is that everybody? Spring force. So spring force spring is force. equals to Mg. Am I right or wrong, all of you? Yes? Yes, sir. Yes, which is equals to spring force. Now same way here. So here, if it is Fsp means, then here also how much it is? Here also it is FSP only. Is it right or wrong, everyone? So FSP, it is acting away from the string or towards the string? So that towards the body or away from the body? Away from it. Am I right or wrong? So here it will act. Away. Here it is. So there also it is equals to MG. And here weight of the body is acting downward direction. So what is the weight, everybody? Which is equals to? 2MG. 2MG. Same way, the, it is a string. So same thing. So if you if here tension is acting T. So T is equal to how much? All of you. Two forces. So 2mg plus mg, which is equals how much all of you? 3mg. So then yeah. here also downwards, again tension is same. That is also 3mg. Clear? Mr. Monish, Mr. Dreswa, that is what. So here what is the weight? Actually mg. Then here mg and 3mg. Then what is the here uh, string force? What is that? The string force which is acting. Fsp is equals to mg plus 3mg, which is equals how much? 4mg. So these many things we have to notice. Now, as soon as if you cut the string, as I told you, so tension in the string will become how much? Everybody. As soon Zero. as you cut, the tension in the string will become how much, Ra? All of you? Zero. Tension will become zero. So that's all. So now, let us start with the first body. As we all know, this, this body, C body, or you can take whatever the body. So the C body will, sorry, A body will go down or by coming to up. All of you. Down. Yes. A body will go down. B body also will go down. And a C body will come. Like it will spring upward. So let us start with the C. Now if I imagine a C as a C, C body. 
as a like FBDs, free body diagram. So how to draw free body diagrams now? One force is acting upward, that is what FSP is equals to 4mg and downward two forces are acting. What is that? One is weight, weight is equals to mg and as well as before the tension is 3mg. But now what is the tension as soon as if you cut, what is the tension everybody? All of you, zero. tension will become how much? Ra? Tension T will become zero. Understand? Zero. Asvita, Laksha. So that is the first thing, free body diagram. So yeah. I can write then second second free body diagram for 2M. So let me take B. So the B body, B, all of you draw that free body diagram, everybody. Yes. So second, if you draw free body diagram, so which is equals to how much it will come? So one force which is acting upward, tension becomes zero. So T is equals to zero. Next. So we know that there is a two forces acting downward direction. So what is that action? One is weight, which is equals to 2mg and another force, which is FSP. So FSP is equals to mg. Am I right or wrong? Yes, sir. Please. All of you? Yes, sir. Okay, so that is what uh, you have to remember. So this is what second body. Then what is about the third body, A body, A body, last body. So draw the free body diagram for A. What is that? Upward force, which is equals to FSP is equals to how much? Ra? FSP is equals to fastly MG and downward force, which is equals to weight, which is equals to also MG. So as we all know that both forces are opposite and equal, then what is the acceleration of A body? Anybody can tell? Opposite and equal. So that both bodies, what is that? Everybody. Ground. Yeah, mg is equals to mg. So that means in the sense of, what is the acceleration? Acceleration of A is equals to zero. Because the forces are acting opposite and equal. So that opposite and equal mm -hmm. means, what is that? Acceleration of A body is said to be zero. Understand, yeah. Pradosh? Laksha, sir. that is what. So whenever the forces are become equal and opposite, then the body is said to be in rest. There is no motion, like tug of war. So there is a rope. This side also same equal force and this side also same equal force. Then there is there any movement in the is there any movement in the rope? Is the left side or right side? No. no movement. Because they are applying the equal forces, then by this time, like it's a balanced forces. So the if it is a balanced forces, no acceleration or no displacement by the body. So what is the acceleration of the A body? Acceleration of the A body become zero. Now let us come to the B body. So what is a B body? This is a B body. Now if you notice it, so B body, what is the net acceleration? We want to find acceleration. So it will act downward direction or upward direction? Net acceleration, F net divided by M. So what is F net draw? Everybody check it here. So only one force, tension is zero. So 2mg plus mg. So what is that F net equals to? Fastly, F net is equals to 2mg plus 2mg plus mg, which is equals to how much? 3mg. Divided by m. So 3mg divided by m. Mm will get cancelled. So acceleration of B is equals to how much? Yes, yeah, sorry. Mass is 2m, not m. So 2m. So what is the acceleration, everybody? Fastly, 3 by 2g. Am I right or wrong? So it will act downward direction or upward direction? Downward or upward? It will act downward direction. So acceleration is equal to 2 by 3g. Do you all solve it or not? Please respond. Yes, okay. Sir. Next. Oh. As we know that C body is attached to the spring so that the body will go up. So we all people knows that. So C body, if you notice it, what is the, what is the F net equals to? Everybody check it. What is the F net equals to? 4 mg, this is mg. Am I right or wrong? All of you? So 4 mg minus, yeah, minus mg, which is equals how much f net equals to fastly? f net is equals to, yes, 3 mg. And we all know that mass is equals to what? Mass is equals yeah. to m. So acceleration of C, acceleration of C is equals to f net divided by m. So M is equal to 3 mg divided mm -hmm. by M. MM will get cancelled. So acceleration of C is equal to how much? Ra? 3 times of G. So and it will go upper direction or downward direction? It will go in a upper direction. So acceleration is equal to 3 times of G. So that is what upward direction. Do you all clear everybody? 
Yes. So this is one of the most important question. Like these questions, you can find even in J and NEET also. But this much time you cannot be. You have to spend more past term and you have to do it. Okay. So this is what this question. So let's go with the next question. All of you. Okay. Clear everybody. So we'll go with the next question, solve it. More response. Asvidan Nasrud, Mani and Samia. Mr. Rishi. Okay, so yes, those sir. who are already solved, you can. If not, you can try now. So this is how we can find the acceleration of this one. See, till now, we are cutting what? This question and before question also. We cut the string or spring up. String. String. So as I already mentioned you the statement, if you cut the string, the in, immediately the string, the tension will become zero. But there is no change in the spring force. But next sum, we are going to cut the spring. If you cut the spring because of elongation, that is what equilibrium position. So definitely if you cut the spring, there is a change in the tension in the string. Do you all understand what I am saying? Hello, yeah. you. So if you cut the string, there is no change in the spring force. But if you cut the spring, definitely there is a change in the tension. Tension in the string. Clear everyone? So there is a, that is. So now let us yes, see sir. that, how to find it. So there is a question now we have. So I will draw the question and I will explain you. You all people observe. So there is a rigid surface where a spring is attached. So for the spring, let me take a little bit more. So a body is attached to that. The body is having a mass M. So let me take that body is C. And there is a spring which is a mass of 2M is attached. Same question like previous. Now there is a spring. There is a spring. So where M mass is attached. So three bodies A, B, C. Now instead of before we cut the string. Now we are going to cut what guys? After attains the equilibrium, spring is cut after equilibrium so that after equilibrium, then find acceleration of A, acceleration of B, and acceleration of C. So we start now, everybody. All of you? Yes. So now if you have any doubt, please immediately kindly ask me. Let us start. Before cutting, we should know all the forces. Now, what is the force acting downward direction here? Fastly respond, everyone. What is the force which is acting downward direction? Mg, which is acting upward direction? Spring force. Spring force as equals to also Mg. So it is the same string. So that here the force again same. Fsb is equals to Mg. And here the weight is acting downward direction. What is the weight? 2mg. And here is the tension. So the same string, tension. Here also same string. It is a tension. Before me, you should say me. 2mg plus mg. What is the tension? Everybody. 3mg. Tension is 3mg. Now here again the gravity is acting. Weight. Weight is equal to how much everybody? mg. So that here again the spring force Fsp is acting. Fsp is equal to mg plus 3mg. Which is equal to how much all of you? Yes. 4mg. Do you all able to write this thing? That is what is my question. Mr. Rudreswa. Rishi, yes, sir. Yes, if you are speaking, I don't know whether you are understanding or not. Ishali completed. Understand, Asvita, what is happening? Solved or not, Manya? Yes, sir. Yes. Now they are saying what? Yes, they attain the equilibrium. You have to redraw the diagram. Now the spring is cut, not the string. So as we know, string is cut means there is no change in the spring force. But now we are cutting the what? Spring. So then what is the, what is the, I am by using a scissor, I am cutting the spring. So then what is the acceleration of A, B and C they are asking. So, so let's start now, everybody. All of you. So okay. as soon as if I cut this spring, then FSP will become in the string will become how much? As soon as if I cut after equilibrium, so FSP in the spring will become how much? Ra? Yes, please. Tension also becomes zero if yep. I cut the string. If I cut the spring, FSP is the spring force will become zero. But there is a change in the tension. Understand what I'm saying, everyone? Laksha, if I cut the string, 
Yes, sir. Tension will become zero, but there is no change in the spring force. But if I cut the spring, spring force will become zero, but definitely the tension is not remains constant. There is a change in the tension. That is what I'm saying. Do you all understand? All of you? Pradosh? Okay. Now, yes, sir. let us observe very carefully. Now, first body. Let me take C body. So, what is the forces acting everybody after cutting? Everyone respond. So, one force is acting upward, FSP. FSP will become how much if I cut that? FSP will become? Zero. Zero. Then downwards, Zero. one force is acting, M. And as well as some other force is acting. What is that force? Tension, T. But is the tension is equals to 3 mg? No. Why tension is not equals to 3 mg? As I said, if you cut, what happened? Change. The, if you cut the string, keep it in mind, spring force. Spring force is not change. So remain spring force is constant. Of course, by the time T will become what? Zero. If you cut, if you cut spring, okay? So of course, spring force will become zero, but T is not constant. T is not constant. Do you all understand? of you. So, yes, now here the T I cannot write as a 3 mg. Am I right? Understand all of you? Yes. yes. Sir. Next. First, let me finish the A body. A body reaction is equal. Action is equal to reaction. Then what is the acceleration? Fastly. A body. Zero. Up is mg. Down is also mg. So that, what is that? Zero. Acceleration of A body is equal to fast. Zero. Because it is opposite and as well as what? Same. So that will yeah. be zero. Clear everyone? Understand Nisali, Laksha, Manya and Samya? That is yeah. it. Now, if you observe second yeah. body, middle body alone, observe very carefully. As the tension is changing, I mentioned here, if you cut the spring, there is a tension change. So second body diagram, tell me all of you, what is the second body? Totally four forces are acting. So what is that? One is upward force, tension. So that is what I'll take T, but T is not constant. But down weight is acting, 2 mg. And as well as something, spring force is acting. What is the spring force which is equals to? Check it, everybody. What is the spring force in this body? Spring force MG. is equal to how much? M. Fastly, spring force is equals to what? Mg. Mg. Clear, everybody? Now, so as I told you, now, so the tension is not constant. So tension is not equals to 3 mg because if you cut the spring, tension will change or not? Fastly, everybody. Tension will yes, change sir. or not? Yes. But I am cutting the spring. But this, this two bodies, M and 2M, both are attached with the same, uh, same string or different string. Everybody. Yes. Same please. string. Same string. Then definitely this T, the T here and the T here, both will be same or different. All of you, fast. Same, sir. Same. Same, sir. Yeah, that is what. So please make it all of you. So as we know that B and C, B and C connected with the same string, connected with the same string, so that T will be remain same or where is? T will be remains same. Clear everyone? So that is what. So let us imagine that there is only two bodies now. I cut it and I attach it only these two bodies. Spring is not existed in mass. Now here also what is the tension everybody? T. And here also what is the tension? Fastly. Here also tension is how much? All of you. T only. Am I right or wrong? Yes, please. Yes. Respond. Ra. That is what. Now. Yes. Yes. So now if you did this one, so we can say that that is 2mg and as well as spring force is acting mg. So now you can see, I can equate this one. As you know, this body will move downward direction, acceleration, upward direction. Acceleration, both the bodies. Down. After cutting, acceleration is what? Fastly. Acceleration is downward, direction. downward direction. Then, downward. yes. So for you can see that first, if you notice it, for example, let me calculate individually like before case. So A, A is equals to F net divided by M. So for this body, let me calculate. What is the acceleration will come? F net equals to? 4 mg divided by m. Mm will get cancelled. So what is the acceleration of uh, acceleration of C body, everybody? Which is equal to how much? 4g. Am I right or wrong? Check it here. So 4 mg, 4 mg, and which is equals to what? 
sorry here because this is zero this is zero guys only this time is acting so this is mg plus 3 mg which is equal so much if i consider this is as a 3 mg so mg plus 3 mg how much ra which is equals to 4 mg divided by m. m so what is the acceleration of c 4g next f net is equals to f net divided by m which is equals to f net this body 2 mg plus g mg what is the answer 2 mg plus mg fastly 3 mg minus upward also something is t equals to what rudreshwar we all knows that t is equals to what 3 mg am i right or wrong so 3 mg divided by mass is equals to 2 m so that this body acceleration is coming how much zero zero so if both are attached to the same string is it possible to get a different acceleration no sir no it is not possible so as both are attached to the same string so that bodies will never get the different acceleration both will travel with the same acceleration or different acceleration everybody same yes please same acceleration so irrespective of their masses if it is same string two mass two masses are connected so then their acceleration is also what everybody for those then there will be same acceleration am i right or wrong all of you that is what so very very important so that is the reason i taught you this also so please note it that which is not possible basically so so first this body i will i will imagine i can form the equation so check it everybody the weight of the body is acting downward direction and t is also downward direction so net resultant force is equals to mg plus t is equals to ma am i right rudreshwar equation for this first body all of you so only one body yes, so this is mg and acting downward direction t so that f net is equals to what only one direction so mg plus t which is equals to so we all knows that ma ma means what m into a that's all you got the equation or not second body 2mg oh. plus mg 3mg and t is upward direction so what will happen and this is a so this is positive and this is negative so what will happen fastly 3mg minus 2 is equals to 2ma am i right or wrong all of you yes please you should speak yes, unless you speak there is no use now add this both the equation so if i add what will happen tt will get cancel 3mg plus mg which is equal so much ra 4mg 4mg is equals to 2ma plus ma 3ma so both the sides mm will get cancel so a is equal to how much fastly 4g is equals to 4 by 3g so this body is also travel with a is equals to 4 by 3g and this body is also travel with a 4 by 3 into g so that is what both acceleration same or different all of you same all of, yes so the tension is different understand udreshwa so if you want to can find the tension so tension is not like before when it is attached so if you cut the spring all of you remember the tension in the string will change yes clear everyone so what is the acceleration of this one is it interesting or not everybody so both a yeah. and uh, uh, a and b sorry b and c so acceleration of b is equals to 4 by 3g it is acting downward direction or upward direction all of you downward downward so b is equals to also 4 by 3g so which is equals to also downward direction or upward direction fastly downward direction clear everybody all of you understand respond ra yes sir that is so here you have to remember very thing if you cut this if you cut the string there is no change in the spring force only tension will become zero if i cut the spring the spring force will become zero as well as the strings which are attached there will be change in the tension that is what you should remember okay shali mr monish mr rishi we use a kadaya okay clear everybody understand or not yes sir okay. solve it solve neatly is very very important narayan any doubt narayan no sir okay good So the, uh, can you able to understand how to solve now spring uh, spring cutting and string cutting that is okay so now completed means let me know so I will continue with the next concept
So let's go to the next concept. If you if you say completed only, I'll go. Otherwise, I'll wait. No issues. So let's start now. Okay. So now, next concept. So next, we are going to make it basically it is uh, like a spring con spring constant. So we are going to make the if you cut this uh, spring, then what will be the spring constant? Uh, that is what we will work with, sir. Okay. Okay, Rishi, no issues. If you are working, that's fine. Okay. Murali is solving a Murali. So now I will teach you if I cut the spring, then how the spring constant will change us. So that is what? Then how to calculate the new spring concept. So this is very interesting and very important also. So what is the spring constant symbol, everybody? Spring constant symbol. Yes, please. Spring constant symbol. Very, very bad. What is the symbol of yes. spring constant? K. Okay. Now, so let me take all of you. There is a spring now. I'm having a spring. All of you observe very carefully. So having a length L. What is the having length, everybody? Having a length L. And spring constant of the spring is how much? What is the spring constant of the spring? Everybody? K. Okay. Now, I cut this. Cut into two equal pieces. Two equal, two equal pieces. Mm -hmm. So I made it. I made it cut. So means this is the one square, one half, and this is the one half. Now can you tell me what is the length of this one? This will become what? L by two, and this is also will become what? Firstly, L by two. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now the relationship between length and the spring concept. All of you remember. L is inversely proportional to spring constant or spring constant is inversely proportional to L. So according to that, can you tell me if length become L by 2, what is the new spring constant? For this one, 2K and this is also will become how much? Ra? 2K. 2K. So that is what. For example, if I cut into three equal pieces, anybody can tell me, cut into three equal pieces. So what will happen? Like electricity last year. So I will make it into three equal parts. You all should speak. So I'll make it to three equal things. So L become L by three, L become L by three, L become L by three. So what is the spring constant? 3K, 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 3K. is also 3K. So the new spring constant become 3K. So same way, if I cut into N equal pieces, if I cut into N, N, number, of, N number of equal pieces, so that what will happen, all of you? Yes, please. So NK. I'll make it into, for example, I'll make it into n number of pieces. So then what will happen? This will become, length will become L by n, this length also L by n, this length also L by n, and this length also L by n. So what is the spring constant here? n times of k, n times of k, and n times of k, and n times of k. Do you all understand everyone? Clear? Yes. yes sir. That is what. Okay. So now, as we all know that in mathematics, if you want to remove the proportionality, so what we can assume, everyone, we have to assume some constant. So k is equals to, I'll say that, constant into 1 by L. Now L will come this side, like a resistance formula, class 10 will find. K is, sorry, k into L, k into L, which is equals to what? C means what, everybody? K into L, C means what? Fastly, C means constant. constant. That is what you have to remember. So length into spring constant is equals to, there is a constant. So that is what it is happening. So, okay. So this is what. So if I cut, what is the relationship between length and uh, length and spring constant, everybody? Both are inversely proportional to each other. Clear, everyone? Okay. Shall you understand, Rudreswa? So both are inversely proportional yes, to each other. Now, so let us solve the numericals and we can make parallel and series connection and the proof also. So observe very carefully. 
Now I will I will teach you the question. All of you observe. So there is a spring. See that all of you. I cut the spring into one is to two ratio. How I cut everybody? One is to two ratio. So one there is one. a length called as L. Okay. So there is a length called as L and spring constant is K. Now I cut it into one is to two ratio. So this is what the ratio I cut it. Then find ratios of understanding. Find the spring constant ratio of ratio of new spring constant new springs in length is 1 is to 2 find new spring constant find new spring constant that is what is the question so how you people will solve that is what is my question so how to solve it everybody so this is the part so now this is remaining part so totally how many parts actually we, we, we cut into 1 is to 2 parts. Then what is the total ratio? So 1 plus 2 is equal to so how much? Total ratio is three. equal to 3. Then what is the length here? Firstly, 1 by 3 into L. And here what is the length? Everybody. 2 by two, 2 by 3 into L. Am I right or wrong? All of you? Yes. yes. Then this will become, length will become L by 3. This will become 2L by 3. Then... Can you tell me what is the spring constant? If the length is L by 3 means, what is the spring constant? Fastly. 3. Yes. Very good. So, 3K. What is the spring constant? Spring constant is how much? 3K. Then length is 2, 2 by 3L. Then what is the spring constant? 3K by 2. 3K by 2. Mr. Udreshwar only understand. Others understood. Aswita, I am asking you only. Clear? Understood, everybody? That is what. Now, if suppose, if I cut it into 3 is to 5 parts, then can you tell me what is the spring constant? I cut it into 3 is to 5 parts. Then this is 1 and this is 5 parts. Then what is the length here? All of you. 3 by 8 L and here this will become 5 by 8 L. So that is what 3 L by 8 and here 5 L by 8. So what is the new? What is the spring constant, everybody? Spring constant will become... 8k 8K by by and here 8k by 8k by 5 that is how you have to find the new spring constant when if the given spring is cut in a particular ratio so that is what you have to do it everybody solve it meeting is going to end solve it then i will teach you one small concept and we'll wind up the class do you all understand able to understand or not everybody wow. yes Ishali, why yes, are you talking huh? okay so solve it so that is the relationship between length of a spring and as well as spring concept. Uh, sorry, spring constant. So I hope you all understand how to find when it is in a ratio. So 3, three plus 5 is equal to 8. So 8 parts, if you cut into 8 parts, 3 parts are separate together and 5 parts are separate together. So this is 3 by 8L and this is 5 by 8L. Is it okay, guys?